Well, I guess now would be as good a time as any to start building towards the beast. So I'm going to be doing this for a while. We are the beast. These are all the tasks, or the sets of tasks, or blocks rather, that I will need to complete. And these tasks, or blocks, listed all around the beast. Here's blood, sweat, and tears. Here's burn rubber. This is probably the industrial craft miner, by the way. Items of power. These are all from equivalent exchange. Is there another? Nope, that's the ass end of the monument. Over here is small but mighty. All of these look to be from red power. I'm not sure what the accelerator is. Oh, those are the, light, the lights they have on the bottom of this monument. Here's gated logic. Logistics pipes. These are buildcraft. A redstone paradise. Most of this is vanilla buildcraft. Well, wait, no, it isn't. The clock is vanilla Minecraft. Well, the piston is vanilla. The rest of it is random stuff that uses redstone. But it's all mob stuff. Industrial craft again. Various explosives. <clears throat> Solar power, various uh most of this is industrial craft. But like this the solar arrays, the solar helmet and the industrial craft solar panel, those are all industrial craft. The red power solar panel is, well, I don't even have to explain that. The light sensor is red power. The apiary, apiary is, really? Oh, right, bees, dirt. And the collector mark three is uh, equivalent exchange, but it requires solar power to uh, do anything. The Bronze Age, these all look to be forestry machines. The Rings, all of these are equivalent exchange. I still haven't found that first one. I guess it's up here. Further up. Yep, here it is. A screwdriver, a transmutation table, an automatic crafting table, iron chest, a stone bowl, project table, a scoop, four torches, and a jungle wood block. 
I'll be coming up to each of these... and uh, destroying the signs as I make what's there. Uh, these are going to be... Those are all equivalent exchange items, and those are going to be the hardest to get. A near-depleted uranium cell? Okay. Anyway, it's time to head back. Where is the sun? Where is the sun? I do not know. I'm going to keep breaking cobblestone until I have at least a stack. Maybe two stacks. I'll just keep one stack for now. There's a pig man. Hey there, buddy. I'm, I'm gonna have to ask you to get on the other side of this landing. Thank you kindly. I'm going to need more cobblestone. Instantly. And I'm pretty sure that when I get back up there, there's going to be a zombie or a skeleton or something. Drowning. Can't have that. And so we enter into our first actual night that I'm not going to sleep through because I have my dark matter pickaxe on me. And I want bone meal. Wait a second. I've got an idea. A good idea at that. Oh. 
Oh, I've got a bunch of planks. And I'm about to have a bunch of cobblestone. Because as well as having another base, I'm going to want this. In fact, it's why they gave me five obsidian. else I could cook? Nope. This is a very important item. Transmutation table. doing this for a while. I'm gonna put away my pickaxe, get the rest of my cobblestone, and head down.
I probably should have brought my dark matter pickaxe with me. Well, regardless, I want to build a way back up. So I don't have to, uh, always go jumping around in the water so much. If I build a 2x3 spiral staircase, it should give me enough room to jump up every step without having to break anything. Well, the staircase isn't complete, but I need the pickaxe anyways. You know what would be a faster way of getting up? Let's see what's in all these ender pouches, by the way. Ah. Beehives. I should really stop that from hurting so much. Well, back to the cobble gen. I'll see you when I've got something to record. Going back down to the, uh, nether. With some materials. <clears throat> I'm going to give the pigmen a little bit more space to spawn. Hopefully that will mean more pigmen are going to spawn. That looks like some gold. <laughs> Here they come. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Isn't that lucky of me? Three gold. Four. Man, I haven't even been down here that long. Come here, piggies. Come to Giga. Ah, that's not good. Get down from there. Well, uh, I'll go back to the overworld with this. I was right. This does allow enough room. I don't need to safe proof these stairs because it's not like idiots are going to use them. It's not like something's going to be all, oh my, I better jump off. Or, hey, it's going to be a great idea to hang off the railing like this. So I've got rotten flesh. And I've got four gold nuggets. These gold nuggets are precious. They are my window into the entire challenge. Let's take a look here. What have I got? That reminds me. I'm going to take a note from the, the short time I had with Mike. And I'm going to make a tree grow in area. I kind of want a skeleton to pop up, so that I can kill it and get some bone meal. Or a bone. Well, if I got some bone meal, well, I'd have bone meal right now. Almost. Uh, how much was one of these? 227. Wow. That's a... That is a lot. Uh, I gotta light this place up, too. I don't see any mobs flying around over there. Let's place this over here. For now. 